The interface has seen a major upgrade in Moho version 12. If you're a long time user, no doubt the first thing that'll catch your eye is the new color scheme. On top of that, the icons have been redesigned, they're now bolder, and you can change the colors in addition to the highlights you have on your interface. Right now you can see my highlights and my icons are all orange, and you can change that, which I'll show you here in a moment. Beyond the colors and icons, the layers and library panels have seen major updates in this version. The library has been redesigned from the ground up and now integrates seamlessly with Moho, while the layers panel gives you way more options for organizing and customizing your workflow. We have individual tutorials for both of those panels, so be sure to check those out. For your interface, if you ever want to change the brightness of your panels or the highlight colors, simply come up here to your file menu. For you Mac users, you'll find it under Moho. It'll be Preferences. For Windows, you'll find Preferences under the Edit menu. So I'll just go to Preferences. And if you're a longtime user, you may note that GUI Colors has been replaced with Appearance, which is on the far right on the top. Just go ahead and click on Appearance. And you'll see we have two dials. And once again, this interface has been streamlined from previous versions of Moho. With brightness, you can toggle the look of your panels. So I'll come down here. If we go all the way to the left, we can make it darker. All the way to the right, we'll make it brighter. And then we can come down here and anything in between. You can always click default to bring everything back to how it was. Highlights allow you to change the icon colors as well as highlights. You can see right here I have one around OK, around this layer. The one color you choose will apply to all of that. Now you have two options, dark highlight and light highlight. This refers to your brightness setting. So if you have a dark scheme, like we do right now, you would choose the dark highlight. But as an example, let's say I bring the brightness all the way up to white and click OK. You can see now the interface updates and my icons are no longer orange, they're blue because they're taking advantage of the light highlight. So that's how that works. And you can always use the sample widgets to check out how your colors will appear with different interface options. So the button, that's how it'll appear when you click it. This is how your checkboxes will look and so on and so forth. I personally prefer to have my brightness all the way down with my highlight set to a green. So let me come in here and let's go with something like that. Click OK, click OK. The interface has updated and I prefer to have a look like this. The best part is you can change your colors at any time by going back into the preferences panel. If you'd like more information, tutorials, or to purchase Moho, visit moho.smithmicro.com. <laughs>